It's a beautiful day in Tuscaloosa, and it's a big day for both LSU and Alabama. Each has won one game in this three-game series to date. The rubber match this afternoon here at Jewel Thomas Stadium. The go part of it. Hard hit past Williamson, and that's where that run is going to come in. Duplantis advancing the second, now scores on the double into the right field corner. So Smith with a double to right and an RBI. Duplantis scoots around to score, and LSU takes the early one to nothing lead. And we're tied at one apiece. Second walk of the inning. And strolling in is Auerbach from third base, tying it up here. Saul Garza, and he takes his first pitch. Deep left, T.J. Reeds, will he have enough room? Nope, it's out of here. Saul says so long with a drive to left, and LSU takes the 2-1 to lead. That's one hit down the left field line. It'll score at least one and two. And a two-run single to left by Gavin Dugas. Back. And that one fouled away off a 91 mile an hour. Was it going to make the line or is it going to get out of here? The jump. And it's out of here. I thought it was going to go foul down the right field corner. But Cabrera takes Davis Vayner to the deep corner. And despite the jump by Gentry and despite the fact that it didn't curve as much as I thought, LSU pads their lead to 5-1. Hit towards the gap on his high horse, Brett Auerbach. He'll easily score. And McCullough with an RBI single to left center field. It's a 5-2 ball game. Bouncer right side. What a play at second base. What a play by Hughes, who just came in as a defensive replacement for Dugas. The bounce out will score a run as Robinson trots in from third to make it a one-run ball game. And a swinging strike three. Holcomb throws his bat in disgust as he walks back to the dugout. And the ball game is over. A 5-4 victory for the LSU Tigers.